the hell? There's this dude jogging down my street without a shirt. He's like, he's like 27. I don't want to see that. Put your shirt on, man. It's the middle of summer. Anyway, Sunday vlog, July 32nd, August 1st, 2010. Um, uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I left my keys in my mom's car, and my sister took the car to Redondo Beach, and she's gonna be there till Thursday. So, my mom was screaming, she was calling me a fucking moron for leaving my keys in the car. I'm like, look, I had no idea she was going to be gone for the fucking four days. So we searched and we found my spare key. I almost threw it out, but there it is. It's broken in half at the handle, but it still works. i got to remember to turn the camera over whenever I put it on my lap because of yesterday. Had that incident. My uh, collar b bones are sore. I was I was pitching yesterday at the park with my dad. Uh, ah, shoulder sore. Everything's sore. It's ridiculous. And I was doing a lot of climbing too, so my back sore. Um, going to walk dogs today. Yeah. Pretty sure the Indian buffet is closed. I'll just get the Mexican. Food. I'm content with spending my eight bucks, getting my Mexican meal, quesadilla combo, the burrito, the drink. I'm fine. That dude's no, he's all right. Um. So what was my next talking point? I had three talking points today. The key. Oh yeah, being sore at the park. Two. It's my third. Huh. Huh. What is it? What's going on? Oh, yeah, yeah, Um, so, I gotta confirm tonight with the, the manager of the guest list for the Virginia meet on August 11th if he can host one more. So they said, they, they're trying to say they have 25, and, and it's a hard cap at 25. I thought it was a soft cap at 25, a hard cap at 30. Like, the exceptions get in until there's 30 and absolutely no exceptions. So I don't know what's going on. So I got to confirm if it, if it's okay to make a last minute registration, then I'll go there. If not, I might still go there and sleep in the woods and just visit people. I mean, what are they going to say? You can't show your face around here? Then I'll hide. I'll hide in the lake and scare people if they if they tell me that I'm not allowed to be there. I'll shit does a duff shit in the woods, of course. I mean, I'm not afraid to live among nature for a few days. Anyway, so that was my third talking point. Let's see if I have any extra talking points. Um, iPhones, kind of a dead day. Just trying to sell these two to this guy in Russia. I gotta lower the price on the other ones. Sell them. Um, what else? Chicks? No, I don't see any, any chicks. Dogs? Well, I'm going to walk dogs, but... Chicks, dogs, what else? Huh. Huh. Dudes, do I know any gay guys? No, I don't. Huh. So, chicks, dudes... Oh, yeah, there was a party down the street last night. I didn't go in, though. That was about it. Uh, what, is it gonna, what was I going to say? I got nothing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, how many minutes am I in? Four minutes, so I, I got a good five minutes. Okay, so my dream, this will be my first dream in, like, presentation ever, live. First or second. I had a live dream presentation with Lisa and... Uh, Freddy Krueger, but it got deleted. No, it didn't get deleted. I got too lazy to upload it. Oh yeah, it did. Well, no. yeah, it got deleted. Then I had to re-record. Re ah, fuck it. Forget about it. it. Just didn't work out. So, um, 
pulling in in, in about two minutes. It's all right, I can go longer. Um, so the dream. So uh, I don't know. I, I guess it starts out. I'm in Brazil, and I'm talking with this Mexican chick about Japanese. And I'm like, oh, you studied Japanese? And I'm like, I took a class in Japanese, and she said, oh, I took Japanese one through three, then the four through six, and the seven through nine, and then eleven, and I'm doing twelve now. And I'm like, what happened? Ten, Japanese course ten. She's like, forget about course ten. Anyway, so I'm flirting with her, and then I purchase like a sheet of collectible hundred-dollar bills, two-hundred-dollar bills. Except I'm looking at the sheet after I've purchased it, and they're white with a little brown fading on them. And I ask him, "Why the paper is this color? Are these counterfeit?" Like I had a business deal with this guy to buy them. Blah blah blah. There, I was gonna. They were collector's items. I wasn't really gonna make any money on them, but I just wanted to have them. So she's. I was. I was really suspicious. I'm like, no, not another b bad business deal. Fuck this crates. Right in my parking spot. I'm gonna have to go over it. Ah, oh, fuck. Let me see what I can do here. Stuff the master at work. But there's a pole there. Don't really want to hit hit the pole, or do I? Huh? How do? I gotta get an angle on this. There, there we go. It's back in a little. Oh, what's that sound? Oh shit! I hit the pole. Sorry. Just pull forward a little. No, I'm in. Perfect. Ah, oh, fuck! I hit the crate. All right. Anyway, so let me finish this dream. So I'm really suspicious, pissed off. I made another bad business deal. On the, I was just trying to get on the right track again. It can't be happening again. No way lightning can strike twice. So, um, I decide to take it up with the actual people who sold it to me. They're in L.A., luckily, not in Brazil, where I purchased it. So I go to the office, except... Right across the street is an IRS office. I know IRS doesn't handle currency, but there's still the Department of Treasury. So I go into the office, and oh no, there's a big, fat, huge blonde woman there. She's trying to stonewall me from getting to the, the agent and examining the truth of these, these uh, sheet of bills. Okay, I got, I got two minutes. So, I'm like talking. She knows what I'm doing. I know what she's trying to do. So she's talking. She's like, hey, baby, what's going on? I'm like, uh, nothing much, nothing much. Just walking around. Hey, you know, you, you, your company sold me these sheets. And why are they printed on just white paper with a little brown fading? What's going on? She's like, oh, don't, don't worry about it. The, you, you can use them. Yeah, just do it. And then I'm like, that's it. Take off your clothes. So she takes off her clothes. Well, I didn't say that. I just made a motion with my hand. And she was naked. And I started, like, rubbing her vagina. She had, like, the shaved pussy. I was rubbing it and spreading it. She's, like, five, seven hundred and eighty pounds. This huge blonde woman. I'm getting in there, man. I'm all over it. Then I, then I get in there with my, my crotch. I'm going, I'm going. I back out. She's she's like losing it. She's she doesn't know my. I'm just trying to distract her to find the IRS guy and confirm that these are counterfeit. And then she's like, she's coming out of it. And I'm like, no. So I gotta get down there with my tongue. And I go to work. I finish her off. Bam. That's the dream. <laughs>